While the law was about the crucifixion in the Bible, the Apocrypha relates the conversation that transpired between Satan the captain of death and Belzebuth the prince of hell. In the realm of the underworld, Satan informs Belzebuth about the impending arrival of Jesus of Nazareth. Prepare to receive Jesus of Nazareth, who boasted that he was the Son of God, and yet was a man afraid of death, stating, My soul is sorrowful even to death. Satan accuses Jesus of undoing the harm he caused on the people, by healing them and even resurrecting the dead, thereby taking away the souls Satan had in his possession under Belzebuth. In response, Belzebuth questions the power and identity of Jesus, who could perform such miracles, but scared of death. Satan however reveals his role in Jesus' suffering, admitting to tempting him and inciting the Jews against him. He takes pride in preparing the instruments of Jesus' crucifixion. As the Lord's death draws near, Satan plans to bring him to hell, subjecting him to their joint dominion. However, the Prince of Hell becomes apprehensive upon realizing the power of this Jesus. He recalls instances where Jesus resurrected Lazarus, and sets free those who were held captive under death's grip, seeing he trembled at his voice. Recognizing he could be the one prophesied to come, and fearing the consequences, the Prince of Hell pleads with Satan not to bring Jesus to hell. He said, But if he be this powerful as a man, I affirm to you, that he is the Almighty God, and no one can resist his power. Perhaps when he said he was sorrowful of death, he said so to ensnare you as a prey, that you might execute your schemes on him. Do not bring him here, otherwise he will liberate all those whom I hold in prison, and set them free from death. To find out more, please subscribe and turn post notification on.